and welcome. Welcome to the ANSYS Innovation course on the Microstrip Patch Antenna. Applications like 5G, ADAS, V2X, Vehicle to Everything, ADAS plus V2X solutions connect the car vehicle with its environment for communication, guidance, or collision avoidance. And they use some antenna configuration. Now the safety and the reliability of that autonomous system is heavily dependent on the design of all the elements that are used in the radar system and the simulation tools that enable the design and the development of these entire systems. And antennas play an important part in these systems and a significant amount of research has gone into developing antennas for these applications and the impact of the environment on these signals as well as any other existing wireless signal source about also impacts the transmission of these signals. So this means we need to accurately simulate the complex environment and the scenarios and we need to take into account the propagation effects whether they're from scattering from reflections from conducting or non-conducting surfaces or from fading or multipath. The signals can bounce several times before it arrives at its intended target, the receiver. And each time that signal is reflected, it can be attenuated or it can constructively add with itself or perhaps with a harmonic from another wireless signal. Here we show only two antennas, but as we know, there are going to be much more than this. This can be hundreds of signals, hundreds of users. Antennas transmit signals as an electromagnetic wave and it converts it into an electric signal. Or it can receive an electric signal and radiate it as an electromagnetic wave. But knowledge of how these fields propagate is to really understand how to design these antennas. So the current antenna configurations for 5G, ADAS, and V2X, these are commonly configured as an array of microstrip patch antennas. Fundamentally, a microstrip antenna consists of a conducting patch on a ground plane separated by a dielectric substrate. So various mathematical models have already been developed for this antenna and the applications can extend to many other different fields as well. Now the conducting patch can take any shape but the rectangular and circular configurations are the most commonly used. So other configurations are more complex to analyze and they require heavy numerical computations. These can take the form of triangular, a disc sector, a circular ring, a ring sector. And use of an electromagnetic simulation tool allows visualization of that electromagnetic field of these complex configurations and they also validate the analytical equations that describe them. In addition to the visualization of the radiating fields from that antenna element or that array of those antenna elements, tools such as ANSYS HFSS allows visualization of the fields as they travel through the environment, taking into account any propagation effects as well as the impact of any other existing wireless signal. Let's go on to our next video and we'll discuss that antenna element, that microstrip patch antenna. Thank you for watching this introductory video. And to find more information about antennas or application topics such as ADAS or 5G or V2X or any engineering topics, check out our ANSYS learning channel for more videos. Visit ansys.com forward slash courses today. Thank you.